Welcome to Kristen Mashman's vlog where it is nice and sunny and she is going to tell you some fun things about the day. What are you going to talk to them about, Kristen? <laughs> London. London. We're in London with the, with the fake LED boards. <laughs> and this thing. It's nice to meet you. Do you want to take a guess where I am? How frustrating for people that are here for the first time and the, the famous uh, neon wall is actually not a neon wall but just uh, oh static stuff. Who wants static stuff? People want animated stuff. Anyway, uh, I'm, I'm in London as you can see and uh, I'm here for work but they had me flying on uh, Sunday and um, I, the only flight I could book was like at 6 in the morning. So I have the whole day basically to kill in London. Apparently it's going to be 23 degrees today. Um, so that could be worse than killing some time in the city in that kind of weather. But um, as you know me, what I'm probably going to do is end up in a casino later. Um, and then I have to do some work anyway from the hotel room as soon as I can check in. Um, I don't know when check-in is, but I would get a call from the nice people at the Radisson. Uh, anyway, see you later. Like this is the Trocadero Center um, and when I was a teenager, like in the early 90s, uh, I went here. This was like my favorite place in the world and it's the first time I did like a 3D um, virtual reality like helmet you had on. But it was so confusing because it was just all like lines and you couldn't really make out when like the robot was shooting at you so I died immediately. Um, and they had some other really cool stuff in there. And now it's just like a, a, a tacky like souvenir store. I have no idea where the rest of it is. Because um, that's all I can see, so it's a bit sad. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's over 20 years ago that I was a teenager. steps on, I'll find Trafalgar Square. And the thing is I've been to London so often, but somehow I think because uh, it's either like um, sightseeing tours or taking the underground, um, it, it, it's never really clear like how close things actually are. So yeah, I'll find myself at Trafalgar Square. Interesting 
story about this fella. Um, as far as I remember, and I hope it's, it's, it's exactly that one that they were talking about back then. Um, I don't know how you call those things, but where the, the, um, the rider puts the feet in. Um, the artist that has done the sculpture forgot that part uh, of the saddle, basically, of the whole thing. And once it got pointed out, he killed himself. As far as I know, that story belongs to that, uh, that sculpture. Uh, but yeah, might have to look it up again. <laughs> should say that so don't feed the pigeons um, <laughs> it's actually something uh, back in 94 when I was staying in a, um, in a bed and breakfast the lady made us a, um, a lunch pack and in the lunch pack was my very first ever um, salt and vinegar crisps and I didn't know what to expect so I just started eating them and it was so disgusting to have like this vinegar taste in there that I just fed them all to the pigeons and I was surrounded by pigeons in the end it was like a sea of them no idea what happened to them, but there's no pigeons. Everything's really close in London. I'm not sure if you see, but there's the Big Ben over there. So I could just walk there as well, but uh, I actually don't want to. <laughs> it's choking that poor dolphin and it's like vomiting. Ugh. What the fuck? <laughs> No idea what's going on at uh, Lego, but it looks like people want to have it or see it or whatever. It's not even 11 and I have my step goal of a minimum of 7,500 steps already accomplished. How good is that? I think this might be um, not the best place, but I'm going to tell you about my um, current or my new uh, health, weight loss and fitness plan. So this is a better place to explain um, what I'm thinking with my um, health, weight loss, etc, etc. So a bit um, inspired by um, Jamie Staples, by his uh, attempt to lose a lot of weight and basically get on the same level as his brother, so he has to gain some weight. Um, I thought to just jump in and try and work on that a bit as well. I had like two challenges anyway this year, so one was to train for a 5k in, uh, in August. Uh, it's part of like a big marathon thing. And the other one was to, on average, every day um, do at least 7,500 steps. So um, I'm not doing very well on that end, um, but I have to have to catch up. Um, so I thought, why not just do a whole big thing around it, like educate myself a bit more about like um, nutrition, um, get back to the gym more, more regularly, <coughs> and actually try and lose some weight. Um, so the goal is now to get to 75 kilos uh, by the end of the year. Um, that would mean I have to lose 17.5 kilos. Uh, it is doable, um, but it is a bit of a um, bit of a challenge. I'm not going to put money on it or anything like that. I'm just uh, I'm just going to try and, and, and follow that. And also also inspired by um, one of the the poker dealers, Ross. Shout out to Ross. Uh, he's doing a weight loss challenge as well. So I was like, why not why not get started on that? I would really like to be lighter. It's it's, it's a nice thing. Um, anyway, so I'm at the, at the Hippodrome right now. Um, it's a casino just around the corner of uh, Leicester Square. So and much. thank you very much. <laughs> um, and there's a Poker Stars um, tournament going on, but um, there's actually nobody there from the events team. So I know a couple of the players, but, but otherwise not too much. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting beer right now. <laughs> Um, <laughs> thanks. Um, so I just wanted to see how the how the tournament is going. It's quite um, it's quite a venue. Yeah, I can't film anything because it's obviously in a casino. Um, I would love to show you a bit more of this because it's 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 pretty awesome. Thanks. 
Um, but yeah, unfortunately I can't play myself because, uh, you know, like as employees we're not allowed to play. Um, but it's nice to check this out. But for now um, I have some nice food. checked out of the hotel here. Tonight I'm going to travel out to the hotel uh, at, at Stansted Airport because uh, my flight is again at like 6.30 in the morning so I wanted to be at the airport um, and not in the city and then have to venture out in the morning. Um, otherwise, yeah, that's, so that was London. At least I had the Sunday to do a little bit of sightseeing but um, otherwise there's not more to show I guess other than my way back if I film anything. <laughs> Um, don't forget to like and subscribe and write comments. Uh, I will always try and uh, answer those. Uh, and the next trip, I hope, is coming in about three weeks. Um, and there will be hopefully uh, one or two uh, vlogs from there. And it's going to be a place that's a bit more sunny and warm and nice. It's a healthy shop, it's called Whole Foods Market, it's very healthy yeah. apparently. Whole, whole uh, food pizza and cheesecake. Anyway, Whole Foods! <laughs> and a pigeon. 